Maybe I shouldn't do a 40K target because we ain't at 40K. <laughs> welcome and welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are doing a clothing haul you know we have a little bit of shit and pretty little thing but it's mainly you know a pretty little thing clothing haul because that is the title but um you know it's a few little things from other places that i wanted to pair some things up with in this video but you know i really don't want to make this intro too long a couple of these pieces throughout the summer i paired a couple of things up so that y'all can kind of get a vision for some of the items i will have everything linked below so that you guys can go directly to the items and purchase them if you're interested and yeah if you're new here make sure that you click the subscribe button before you dip and let's just hop into the video because i ain't gonna lie i'm a little out of breath y'all could probably tell clothing hauls is a little tiring it's really a workout as y'all should know by now because <laughs> i'm pretty sure when y'all be watching y'all could tell we be out of breath clothing hauls is a job okay but yeah let's go ahead and hop into this video girl okay guys so this is the first shirt don't mind bronco barking in the background if you knew to knew here then y'all don't know but that's my dog bronco and if y'all hear him barking he just saying hey to the girls okay so to be back <laughs> but um yeah so this is the first shirt and it's just this white muscle tee that i got and it like kind of has like a pretty big droop on the side so you may want to wear like a bralette some type of little cute bra up under here i'm not about to do all that for this video but if you know me giving y'all advice on this, I would definitely tell y'all to wear like some type of little cute bralette or, you know, you may go to work out in this or something, so you may wear a sports bra, but I just personally, personally am going to like make this shirt super cute as y'all see, um, if I were to like dress it up, I don't think y'all can see my shoes, but I do have on these pink heels and I paired it up with this white bag um, that I also got from Pretty Little Thing and these silver shades. I feel like my camera is going to darken up when I put these on, but it's just like a whole look to me. So, yeah, super cute, especially with these braids. It's just giving like what it's supposed to give. I also got that same shirt in the black version just because I feel like this shirt is super cute and it's something that I can definitely style very different in different ways. So I just got it in black and white. So I will leave the link down below for both. And I got them in a size, why does it say large? Well, it's a large UK size, but large. Girl, I could have sworn I clicked small. I know I ain't get this in no large. See, this one say small, but this one say large. So I hope they ain't just send me the wrong size in this shirt, Lord Jesus. Cause that's gonna be way too humongous on me. Anyway, yeah, it's the same exact thing, just in the black version. Okay y'all, so next up, I just got this simple black um, ribbed, what do you call these? Just regular tank top and these black cotton shorts. So they do have pockets on them. I got them in a size two and I got this shirt in a small, I believe. This shirt is kind of a, it's kind of, what do they call this? Like a U, is that what they call it? U shape or something like that. I don't know, I can't remember. But um, it's kind of low. I really do like how it's like, cause I really don't like shirts like this. You know, I told you I like the shirts that come all the way up to my neck because I feel like they just suit my face and my like face shape better since it's so long. But I do like the way that this is suiting my face and it does look cute. Um, I actually didn't order this to go together, but it's really cute. It's kind of giving me like skims, but not skims just because it's the same color. And you know, it's just like a set really that I just put together. And this is definitely something that I could wear on the go, you know, traveling. This could be a nice little airport fit, you know, real cute. Throw me on some socks and slides, baby girl. Okay, so yeah this is really cute and also i do like how it's like kind of a look kind of loose it's not super tight 
So if I did want to, I could definitely like tie this up in a knot to make it a little bit more girly and throw it on, throw on some heels with it and some shades and they go another outfit. So I love stuff that I can like, you know, do a lot of different stuff with and it's just not one certain way that I have to wear something. Hold on, lighten up. If I did make this an airport, airport fit, of course I wore my little Dior dupe shades with it. You know, the big ones, cause that's just, yes, like, period. <laughs> the next shirt that I got, now these biker shorts I got from um, Shein, these were in my last Shein clothing haul. But I just got this super cute little graphic tee and it says Monte Carlo. I got it in a size medium. Um, I ordered two shirts from Shein, like a package ago that I got in a size medium and they were super humongous. And I was like, you know what? Dang, I should have ordered those other shirts that I just got in this package in a small because I thought they were gonna fit just like that. So I'm not sure like, I don't know if those shirts said oversized and I just missed it or what, but this right here is fitting like just fine. Like this is how I would like my mediums to fit. But those other shirts I'm talking about was like, like I got them out the big and tall section. So yeah, I got this shirt in a medium. Cause it's like, you know, I kind of want my t-shirts to start fitting a bit more oversized than I've been getting them. But yeah, this shirt is super cute to me. I got it in white. They have it in like a couple other colors, but I definitely just felt like it was like a universal little graphic tee, you know, plain white and black. Something that I can mean I could pair it up with these. I could pair it up with some jean shorts. I could pair it up with a pair of colored pants, you know. I can pair it up with a lot of different stuff. I can dress it up or down with heels or tennis shoes, sandals, whatever the case may be and call it a day, you know. That's why I got this because it's definitely one of those type of graphic tees that I can dress up any kind of way. Some graphic tees are more of like, you know, only for like streetwear type of outfits, you know. So that's why I grabbed this one so I can, you know, dress it up however I feel for that day. <laughs> These cream biker shorts that I got. This top is from Shein. I will leave the link to this as well in the description box, but um, let's focus on these biker shorts for now. So there is this cream biker shorts that I got in a size two. I get all of my bottoms in a size two or a small from Pretty Little Thing. Um, these are see-through. I'm talking about very see-through. They did not look as see-through on the model as they are now. Um, so hopefully I don't have to blur anything out because I think that it's like bright enough. But y'all, I promise you, you may wanna be a little careful. You're gonna have to wear either a thong, invisible panties, or just straight black pink. I don't know, something that's gonna like match your skin because they're super see-through. I may try to go back on there and see if they have another pair that may not be see-through um, because these here are very see-through. If I turn around, y'all will be able to see the tag in the back. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to make sure that that gets understood about these before y'all order them. Y'all aren't as blindsided as I was because I was like, oh wow, you can just see everything. But they're super cute to me. Um, I just threw on this little muscle tee crop top with them. But this is not really how I plan on wearing these biker shorts. I definitely wanted to like pair this up with like all white and probably like throw on a blazer or something with it or some type of jacket maybe. Um, that was kind of the look that I was planning on going for, but you know, now that I put it on like this, this is something super cute that I could wear with like a pair of sandals that kind of look like the Bottega sandals and some shades and a bag and that will be like a more girlier twist to the fit that I was trying to go for. So that's that, size two in these. Let's go ahead and move on into the next one. Hey y'all, so next are these pants that I got in a size two from Pretty Little Thing. They do have the slits on the side. I have these pants in black as well and I got so many questions about them when I posted them. I'm still getting questions about them pants to this day but I think they're sold out unfortunately. But they're in this olive green color and I paired it up with this sage. Yeah, it's more on the sage side of green. This shirt I got from Shein. I'm so obsessed with this shirt, y'all. And I was, like, I was like, I already knew how I wanted to dress it. This is how I want to dress this shirt. So y'all will probably see this outfit on my Instagram. So 
yeah but these pants i got in a size two they are super tight that's one thing about shein's like little legging type of pants they be super tight but i know that a four would be too big on me so i just have to suck it up and be okay with them being super tight because i would rather these type of pants be super tight than baggy because that's not cute okay so yeah this is super cute super cute with this brace as well top i love this look all together okay we're back at it again with some more biker shorts and another graphic tee so this graphic tee i got in a size medium as well these biker shorts i got in a size two both of these are from pretty little thing they're just these light gray biker shorts i love this length of biker shorts this is really how i would like all of my biker shorts to be because like i told y'all i don't like my biker shorts to be those really long so they come down to my knee because i'm already short and i just make you know it's not cute so <laughs> if i could know that biker shorts are going to be this length or longer before i purchase them that would be perfect but they be looking short on some models and long on others so yeah whatever but these are super cute i love these i love the, the length that they are and then this little graphic tee it just has this little yellow butterfly on the front and on the back it says pretty little thing with the butterflies as well i'm wearing it like this but i feel like it would be super cute if i was to wear this like together like this and maybe tie it up in the front and y'all know those silver shades that i had on in the beginning will be super cute with this as well or if i could um kind of make this shirt like a muscle tee that's bomb i like that See, I'll be showing y'all how to twist and turn the shirt so it could be another fit. Like everything, it's just all about what you do with it. Period, baby. It's, it's called fashion, okay? You make it how you want to make it. Okay, y'all, so next I just have this eraser back top that I got from Pretty Little Thing. I got it in a size two. If not a two, I got it in a size small because these type of tops, I expect them to fit like tighter than my actual size so that it can hold up my boots because obviously I wouldn't be able to wear a bra with something like this so it definitely fits like how I would want it because it's holding up my boots so that I don't have to wear a bra and then you know just a natural normal racer back if you know racer backs and then these sweatpants I got from Forever 21 they were linked in my last vlog video but I will link them again because this looks like super cute together this gray and then you know it has little the little detailing on the sides of them so it kind of adds a little bit more to the fit and it doesn't look as basic you know like just regular basic sweatpants and a tank top so yeah this is super cute i'll leave these linked in this video description box so that y'all don't have to go to a whole nother video and go to that description box that's a little bit too much so yes yeah, make it easier for y'all because y'all know i'll be looking out i'll leave them in this video as well um so yeah, that's really all. And then we only have one more um, top. This is the last item. And it's just this little shirt that goes all the way up the neck. And it's actually a crop top and it has the little drawstrings on the side. This isn't something that I would normally go for, but it was just like something that I feel like I will be able to dress in a cute little girly way on a day that I feel like my girly self because y'all know i have a lot of different sides you know sometimes i'm like tomboyish girly girl boss b you know you never know with me it just depends on the day so i'm just like you know one of the days that i'm feeling my girly girl self this is something that i could wear you know and dress it up make it real cute or whatever these sweatpants start from shein not you know included in this haul or whatever but yeah so super cute and this also isn't a color that i really go for but now that i see that i kind of like this up against my skin tone i will start going for this color more it's like a cream but it has kind of like a pale peach undertone to it i guess you could say so 
So yeah, now that I see that I like it up against my skin, I will go for this more because it is kind of cute. So this was the last item and I hope that you guys enjoyed it. All right, so that was all for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I will have everything linked below so that y'all can go and check it out. Um, this video was not sponsored by Pretty Little Thing. I purchased all this stuff with my own money, but y'all know me linking everything. They gonna see. So yeah, y'all gonna run up everything in a link so they can sponsor your girl because baby, I be spending too much money with Pretty Little Thing for them not to be to hit your girl up yet. So. <clears throat> <clears throat> But yeah, I hope that y'all enjoyed this video and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye my babies. I love y'all. And we almost hit 40k. Bye.